today we will do activity 1.7 class 10 chapter number 1 in this activity take a plastic mug drill two holes at its base here and fit rubber stoppers in these holes rubber stoppers are fitted in these holes insert carbon electrodes in these rubber stoppers and carbon electrodes are fitted are inserted in these holes then connect these electrodes to 6 volt battery 6 volt battery is connected fill the mug with water this is water such that electrodes are immersed add a few drops of dilute sulfuric acid to water note this we have to add a few drops of dilute sulfuric acid to water take two test tubes with water these are two test tubes filled, filled with water and invert them over the two electrodes two test tubes are inverted on these carbon electrodes switch on the current when we switch on the current what we observe first observation we observe formation of bubbles at both the electrodes each volume of the gas collected the same in both the test tubes once the test tubes are filled with respective gases remove them carefully test these gases one by one by bringing a burning candle close to mouth of these test tubes what happens in each case so first observation we have to take this and second this and third this we have to test these gases which gas is present in each test tube for this first observation second observation volume of gas collected the same in both the test tube we observe gas on one electrode was more than that of other electrode volume of gas was double than that of volume of other gas third observation test these gases one by one by bringing burning candle close to the mouth of test tubes when we bring burning candle close to the mouth of first test tube a pop-up sound is produced and when we bring burning candle close to the other test tube the light of candle flame was increased so we write these operations first observation was that bubbles of gas evolved at both the electrodes that's because we took water in this beaker and when current is passed through this water every molecule of water decomposes into molecule of hydrogen and molecule of oxygen second observation was that gas on one electrode was more than that of other electrode volume of one gas was double than that of other that's why because in this reaction, we see that when water is decomposed into hydrogen and oxygen, we see here two molecules of hydrogen are formed and only one molecule of oxygen is formed. So, we see that volume of one gas is double than that of other. Third observation was when we brought burning candle close to the mouth of one test tube, pop sound is produced at the mouth of test tube because we know that when hydrogen gas is burnt a pop sound is produced and fourth observation was that the light of candle flame was increased that's why because oxygen helps in burning light and volume of candle flame was increased that's the fourth observation and what we say about which gas is on which electrode here this is anode and this is cathode we know that h2o molecule decomposes into hn plus ohn hn is positive in nature so this decomposes on cathode so hydrogen gas 
evolved on cathode on this electrode and here oxygen this is is negative so this is evolved at anode so we see here the volume of hydrogen is double than that of volume of oxygen and we can see difference on both of electrodes so these were our observation we observed by this activity now in starting of this activity we added few drops of dilute sulfuric acid why why few drops of sulfuric acid was added to water because we know that pure water can not pass electric current through it an addition of acid like sulfuric acid acid makes it an electrolyte in the presence of h plus and so4 ion water becomes capable of dissociation sulfuric acid promotes the reaction or increases the rate of reaction of decomposition we know that pure water does not conduct electricity through it so it is poor conductor of electricity to make pure water conducting we add few drops of dilute sulfuric acid to it and this reaction is an example of electrolytic decomposition reaction electrolytic means electricity decomposition means breaking down into smaller products here one reactant water decomposes into hydrogen and oxygen with the help of electricity so this is an example of electrolytic decomposition reaction so these were observations of this activity i hope you understood this activity very well thanks for watching mm -hmm.